Oh, oh shit. Oh, oh set him up. up. Balance. Set him up. Hey, throw in the towel, y'all. Oh shit. No. Damn, he's down. Don't get up. Don't for who? Oh God. Stop the fight. He's sitting down. Stop the fight. Are you ready for Bivol now? Of course. Of course. Will it be this year? Will it be this year? Yes, of course. Yes, belts. Yeah, yeah, belts. Like, <laughs> we need this fight. And that's it. It's not personal, I think. So it's, it's sport and it's boxing. Dimitri Bivol holds the only other belt at 175 pounds. Is that the fight that you want next? Yes, of course. Undisputed. Undisputed. The morning after. Look, I watched that fight last night, and I woke up with a swollen eye. Watching the fight, I got a swollen eye. Better BF is a beast. Let's make some coffee. And that's the espresso. Ah, look, better BF last night. Look, before I get started, I want to say this. Last night was one of the more hilarious nights <laughs> we had in boxing commentary history. There you go, Column. Little jab here and there. Oh, that right hand from better BF. Okay. Oh, shit. Column, stop. Move your head. Your block ain't enough. This guy is Jason Voorhees. Column is crying blood. He's crying blood right now. Ah. It's like, hey, that's a good jab from Better Be a Boy. Ah! Oh! This guy here needs to go to jail. Put, put, lock, lock him up, throw away the key. Better BF was terrifying. And that fight was a uh, slaughterhouse. Stop the damn fight! It's over with, you moron! <laughs> and what got me more than anything, what got me more than anything is better BF has gotten better. His jab was ridiculous. The way he was cutting off the ring, the way he was hunting, but doing it with high boxing IQ, the sweet science. I keep telling you guys, the sweet science isn't a style. The sweet science is an approach. It's you maximizing your abilities against your opponent styles make fights and the sweet science is what we saw last night too now listen the ring was tiny all right and i understand the the atypical findings <laughs> but <laughs> better bf skill level his his iq was just tremendous last night and listen i lost my 500 dollars so smooth now bro my money that 500 hit the pockets real nasty. I bet 500 on my bookie for Colin Smith to be better BF. I thought he would win. I did. I thought Colin Smith had the power. He looked good at light heavyweight. Better BF, 39 years old, right? I think like this week or maybe next week, he'll be 39 years old. Barroso, better BF, and Bud. BBB, the three Bs, <laughs> 40s, the new 20. And I want to say this. Bilbo and Better BF, they're fighting, okay? They're going to fight next for Undisputed. You got Bilbo already signing up with uh, Saudi Arabia for that fight. Better BF, Bobam, Bobam, who represents Better BF, said that he's going to talk to Turkey. They're about to get it on. So about three months after the end of Ramadan, we'll be ready to fight Bilbo probably in Riyadh. You, you saw Bob Arum and Eddie Hearn both there last night. They're about to fight each other. And I would love to know what you all think about that fight. Bilbo is a better all-around boxer. Wow. Better be if, 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 if Bilbo is a 10-rated boxer, better be if is a 10-rated slugger. Okay? Better be if knows how to hunt. How how to go get you, go after you, break you down, beat you up, break your bones, beat you down, cripple you. Better BF is that guy. 
Wow, Bilbo, Bilbo's not going not going to put himself in too much you know harm's way. He's going to stick and move, box in and out, give you different angles. This is one hell of a fight. I want to say this: this fight may just be determined by other details, like ring size, who's the ref, where's the fight. You you, you get what I'm saying? Who's the judges? All those things. It may be determined by that. These guys are two A plus fighters. I would love to know what you all think in the comments below. Right now, you can't help but to lean towards better BF after what you saw last night, him versus Callum Smith. Callum Smith was his best opponent, and he beat him as if it was nothing. It's funny. Better BF is getting better, and I'm talking about IQ-wise, boxing fundamentals. He was a slugger, but his jab has become one of the better jabs in the business. Um, I want to say this, too. For him to physically be jogging on a treadmill before the fight says he got at least another two years before we start really worrying on about his age. This guy here is built to last 300 amateur bouts. Forget just his pro uh, bouts. What he got? What, 20 and 0, 20 knockouts, 20, something like that. But 300 amateur bouts. I would love to know what you all think in the comments below. If you guys still got Bibble, I definitely understand. This fight is very hard to call. Show, Bibble, don't. I'm out. Huh.